When I was in high school, I had no idea what I wanted to do. When I was in high school, I did not know what I wanted to do. Here in Minnesota, we're surrounded by lakes, rivers, prairies, forests, parks, and trails that provide a special quality of life for all of us. Protecting and preserving these resources creates career opportunities for people interested in the outdoors, science, and public service. I'm Devin Wenthe, and I am a forester for the Minnesota DNR. The Minnesota Department of Natural Resources is the state agency for managing our abundant natural resources. Our mission is to conserve and manage the natural resources along with providing recreational opportunities and also providing commercial uses in a sustainable way of our natural resources. And there are many, many different career ladders in the Minnesota DNR. I think a really cool part about this job is there's so much to do and there's so much to learn that it's really hard, if not impossible, to learn everything. In the winter time, I, I do a lot of timber marking. So that would consist of choosing which trees are going to get harvested and which trees we want to promote for growth. Um, along with that, I, I'll oversee logging operations. So I'll go out and check on loggers that are cutting on state land um, and make sure they're adhering to the guidelines that we've written for them for that timber sale. I do wildland firefighting for the state where I work with the volunteer fire departments and city fire departments to help take out fire. I also do wildland firefighting out of state. Last year I went to California and then the year before I went to Alaska doing wildland fire. Knowing biology is a very helpful tool, especially learning how trees can grow and what trees can grow in certain areas is, is very important. It's also a good idea to be pretty physically fit. This job takes a lot of physical labor, a lot of walking and things of that sort. Forestry is one of the seven divisions within the Minnesota DNR, and each of these divisions is staffed with professionals specializing in a wide variety of career interests. My name is Ann Danielson. I am an aquatic management area technician for the Minnesota DNR. My job primarily focuses on helping manage and maintain the aquatic management areas owned by the Minnesota DNR. I went to high school at Brainerd High School. I really was not entirely sure what I wanted to do after high school. I liked being outside, I liked animals, I liked wildlife. I realized office job 100% of the time is not for me. And what we are really focusing on is getting outside, seeing the AMAs, doing our assessments, which involves getting on the ground and trying to walk the AMAs as much as possible. And we're trying to make sure that they're healthy. So we're checking for invasive species, we're checking to make sure that the habitat is in good quality. Are we seeing the diversity that we want to see? Is there projects that we maybe need to do to kind of help the biodiversity and the health of the habitat? I really like that I get to be outside. I love that I get to go hiking. I mean, I get to basically be paid to go hike, but I get to learn a lot about the ecosystems that we rely on. If you're thinking about a career in natural resources, you should know that there are more than 4,000 related positions located all across the state of Minnesota. These careers can be found in the private sector, as well as with federal, state, tribal, and local agencies, and demand is expected to stay about the same over the next 10 years. The career ladder in natural resources really depends on your area of concentration, but often people gain entry to the field through seasonal or temporary positions, and then, with more education and experience, move up to become technicians, specialists, supervisors, and managers. Everyone starts with those entry-level positions, and gaining that experience at those entry-level positions are very important for making sure that you can grow as an employee to move up that ladder appropriately. That way you don't end up in a position that you're not ready for. Natural resources careers and positions at the Minnesota DNR especially are open to every qualified candidate. We value very much diversity, equity, and inclusion. Our workforce looks and feels like Minnesota in all of Minnesota. I started as an intern 
and then now I'm a forestry specialist. I'm hoping to get the intermediate position and then eventually I'm hoping to be a program manager. The further that you can climb in your education, the further that you can climb in your career. If you start out and as a high schooler, you can do you know, your part-time job, your seasonal jobs, um, maybe some, some lower rank full-time jobs. If you wanna get those professional jobs, however, you do need to have more education. Central Lakes College offers degree programs in natural resources law enforcement and natural resources technology at its Brainerd campus. We kind of give students a little bit of a experience with everything. It's kind of like having to try everything on your plate to see if you like it first. And a lot of students will come in convinced that they're going to go into perhaps a wildlife biology or wildlife management or maybe be a conservation officer. They get in here, they try some things, and they see other opportunities. We're very affordable, but it's also an exceptional program that we have here. So if you have an interest in natural resources, and more specifically, you're kind of curious about how things work at Central Lakes College, we'd love to have you come, uh, get a chance to meet with you if you're considering our, our program. If you'd like to sit in a class and see what it's, it's all about and kind of what being in a class or out in the field might be like, we can make that opportunity available for you as well. As a high school student, it's important to start preparing now for your future career. Ask your school counselor about courses and other opportunities that will help you learn more about careers and natural resources. I would say give it a shot. For me, when I went to college, I had no idea what I wanted to do. I just knew I wanted to work outside. So um, if you enjoy being outdoors, I think this would be a great opportunity for you to, to get in a job like this. You know, at the end of the day, our jobs are maintaining the natural resources for the purpose of the public. I really like my job. I get to do a lot of fun and great things and I get to be outside. Choosing a career and educational path after high school is one of the most important decisions you can make. In a time of life when there are more questions than answers, the Bridges Career Academies and Workplace Connection provides information about education and career pathways and gives you the tools you need to make a smart choice, one that's right for you and right for your future. To learn more, visit bridgesconnection.org.